Hey cookie fans, welcome back. I've got a Dollar Tree haul video today. Now this is kind of a smaller haul because whenever I went to several different Dollar Trees, they were still putting out their Halloween and fall items. So I was only able to get just a few things, even though I went there just to see what was new for fall. First of all, they had the cutest, cutest sunglass holders. So these are absolutely perfect for keeping your sunglasses in. And look at the print. It's everything that I love. I am a kid at heart, so I love everything that's like cute. I'm always on the search for cute little things. So this is like cookies and donuts and popsicles in like a little kitty kind of cat shape. So those are so cute. I did find one fall item. They started getting out some of their fall candles. So I did find this one. This one is pumpkin spice, but it's a jammin' scent. And if you look at it, it actually looks like the jar is like a jam jar. Oh, it smells so good. It smells like pumpkin jam. Like if you took a bunch of pumpkins and mixed them up and turned them into jam, that's what this smells like. Seriously, I mean, it looks it looks like food. It looks like it should be food, but it's just a candle. I can't wait to burn that. They also had these hot and cold little iPads. Now these are so, so, so cute. So you can use them chilled or you can heat them up, but I don't know if I would really heat them up to put them on your eyes. So they're just two little donut shaped ones. I've never seen iPads like this before. And they have like a very jelly consistency. So they're very, very kind of like gummy and watery. So they will chill up very nicely if I put them like in the freezer or in the fridge. I also also found a new phone stand that I'm gonna be putting my phone on. I liked this purple glittery one. So it looks really convenient, very nice. Just easily place my phone there. Okay, I thought this was really interesting. It says save the bees, plant these seeds to save the beads, which is a pollinator kit. So hopefully it will attract bees and they can go about and keep on doing their pollinating thing and keep being amazing in the world. These are very important. Every creature on this planet is very important, which is why we need to protect them. Okay, I also found these two little signs and what what I love about these is that you get to decide who you want to be for the day. So this one says, today I'm a, you just spin this little piece here. So this one says, today I am a dreamer or I'm going to be a rainbow today. Yes, you can be a rainbow. You can be a dreamer. You can be anything. And then this one right here, if you want to go extra special, it's got a glittery unicorn right on the top. And on the bottom, it's got a mermaid who's just kind of swimming. And it's asking you the question, what do you want to be today? So you can either be a unicorn or you can be a mermaid. All right, looks like I'm a mermaid today. So this is how I've been storing some of my earrings. So I just have them in these boxes, which I actually did get these boxes at the Dollar Tree a long, long, long time ago. I probably have them in a haul video somewhere on my channel. So this is how I've been keeping my jewelry. But I thought whenever I saw these little crafter square, little crafting boxes at the Dollar Tree, I was like, oh, wait a minute. Those would be absolutely perfect to be storing my necklaces or earrings or any type of like little trinket inside of these. They make really good little trinket boxes. Boxes, even though they're little craft boxes for you to like put beads in, I'm gonna use them for my jewelry. So on the inside, we've got all these different compartments. So it's got 12 different cubbies for me to store whatever I want in there, which again is perfect for my kind of earrings that are just hanging out randomly that I never had a chance to store. So here's a before shot of my earring collection. And here is an after shot of all of my earrings now organized inside of these little cubbies. This is so cute. Now I can find things so much quicker and faster and they just all really look so, so so adorable now. And for the other cubby, I'm just gonna use it for my rings. If you guys have watched my Shein haul that I did, you guys remember those gummy bear rings that I got? I love those. You know, I actually have the matching gummy bear bracelet that I think I will keep in here too. And for some of this other chunky kind of fun jewelry that I have, I ended up getting this caboodle. So it's just a little container that looks like this. Flip it open and it's got plenty of room on the inside. There's another place which is absolutely perfect for me to store some other additional accessories like some of these chunkier earrings that I have. And it just easily closes up. Oh, I forgot about this. You can actually grow your own tomatoes. I really want to try this and see if maybe I can get some tomatoes to grow. It says you can actually grow up to 10 pounds of tomatoes. Grow virtually anywhere, anytime. Hand selected premium grade seeds. Perfect for indoor or outdoor. The new way to grow tomatoes. It actually says create your own tomato factory. So super simple. Just take the little seed base plant and water. The last thing that I picked up from the Dollar Tree store are these items. Obviously, if you are a super cookie fan, if you're a fan of my channel, you guys know I absolutely love collecting dolls. I'm a Barbie collector for life. I love dolls. So they actually have these really interesting clothing, these little career outfits that I just could not pass up. So we've got a chef, these little camo set ones too. The only thing that I was a little like, oh no, was if you look really closely here, this one has a pair of sunglasses while, oh, that one is missing the sunglasses that came with it. So I don't know if maybe they're 
either underneath the outfit or it was just a factory flaw, but I just, I could not resist these outfits. Speaking of collector dolls, I also have a little small Walmart haul. So I actually found one of the Rainbow High Winter Break dolls. They did not have many of them out. They just had Skylar Bradshaw and this one, which is the red one. This is Ruby Anderson. So these are the two that my Walmarts had. So hopefully I can find the other ones. I'm obsessed with winter clothing and because these are, you know, fashion collector dolls, they come with double outfits that I'm so excited for. So I'm gonna keep them in their package until I find the other dolls. And I'm so happy I was able to find these three extra dolls. This is one of my new favorite lines that Mattel has come out with. I absolutely love it. Here is the first girl right here with the purple hair. Oh, I love these dolls so much. They are so, so, I love like their crazy fashion. She's got like the biggest pearl earrings that you could ever have with matching pearl choker. And then on top of that, cause she's bold, she doesn't care. She's got her fashion thing going on. She's got a charm chain necklace with all the things that she loves. Stars, little sleepy bears, a rainbow. Then she's got like these bear print on her actual like denim with fluffy sleeves, a silver over the hand ring and a super sweet little ice cream cone bag. Yep, and she paired them with her amazingly pearled platform shoes to kind of pull the whole look together. She has some accessory pieces like this pearl chain bag on the days that she doesn't want to use her ice cream bag. She's got this super pearlized one and on her face, she's got some heart shades and everywhere she goes, her little pup with a little bear beanie goes right with her. Yep, protecting her. It looks like a little guard dog. Next is this girl. I love it. Their fashion sense is so loud and crazy. She's got this hot neon green boa that actually on the inside has hologram. I love her hair, how she has like the little pastel rubber bands going all the way down, kind of crimping it into two little ponytails. Big giant silver hoop earrings. She also has a layered star chain necklace that goes over her star print baby doll top, covering some denim black shorts. She also has a giant cocktail ring on her finger and a translucent star bag with shiny gold glittery combat boots. She's got her little Pomeranian pet pup that comes with a little tropical drink and some sunglasses to completely change out the look. Last up, I found this girl right here. She wants you to see the good in everything according to her hologram jacket that has wildly cool leopard print pink sleeves. She's keeping it very retro with her visor and her pigtails. She has dangly star earrings, double necklaces over a crop top and pleated skirt. And she's got a little fanny pack in here too with french fries on it. Yep, she likes salty and sweet. She comes with an ice cream cone and she's got leg warmers over her black pumps. Now the thing about her is that her shoes are a little soft. So if you put too much pressure on her pumps, they do kind of wiggle and bend a little bit. So I do wish they were a little bit of a harder plastic because I want to make sure they don't actually bend like that accidentally and then stay like that. And she comes with a lot of accessories. Actually, one of these pairs of sunglasses might go with one of the other girls. I'm not 100% sure. I might've gotten them a little bit mixed up, but we got two sunglasses just for her to wear. Her pet is a bear that just doesn't care because they're listening to music with their donut headphones and kind of just rolling around to live in life. We've got a boom box, transparent rainbow backpack, and another sweet treat. We've got a blue ice cream. So happy to have these three now added to my collection. Do not miss part one where I unboxed the first wave of these extra dolls and I cannot wait to see what the other wave dolls look like. Now, the last thing for this haul video is I got a package in the mail. This is absolutely perfect for back to school or just for anybody who loves really adorable stationery like I do. How cute is all of this? Now these you can get on AliExpress, you can get on Amazon, or you can get at Wish. And everything was very, very, very cheap. I think everything was like under like $3 for each of these items. First I got this eraser. There were several of them that you could get and they sent it at random. So I ended up getting the green one, which is really cool. Cause look at this, look at how gummy this is. I love that. It looks like a candy and it's got like a little star molded on the front. And that star goes all the way throughout the eraser. So you will always see that. All right, are you ready for the cutest sticky notes ever? Not only are they little sticky pads, but they also have like little page markers too that go and coordinate with them. Like this one is a, like a mama bird with a cage with her little babies. Isn't that cute? That like marked the page. Oh, so cute. You can just stick them on your pages, write on them, write little notes to yourself. They're just kind of cute little happy messages. It's just like a friend, very warm, very lovely. And this one is a panda mom with all of her babies so they can also stick and save 
your pages. And then the last one, perfect and just in time for Halloween, we've got a little ghost with a bunch of ghost friends hanging out right on the bottom, ready to save any of your pages. These ones are so precious too. I've never seen anything like that. You get a little cat and a little box, so it looks like a little kitten that needs a home. It's a kitty house it instead of a kitty post it. It's a kitty house it. <gasps> there it is. Look at the little kitty cat in the box. Can you imagine needing like a little page marker or something and reaching for this? So the cat has a whole bunch of like little sticky sheet papers in there that you can easily grab. They came in a whole bunch of different types. I ordered one of each of the kitties, but it looks like they kind of made a little bit of a mistake with my order because they sent me two of these black and white kitties right here instead of one of each, but that's okay. I will love them. They're so cute. And also I had a hard time folding the box and using their sticky tape that it came with. So I'm probably just gonna go back and tape the box myself. So it actually looks a lot better because right now it looks a little... I also got this little cat paw, which actually is a pin. Very fine point for you to write with. And I also ordered these castle keys. They are a key to the castle. Okay, I'm just kidding. <laughs> what they actually are, are the coolest looking pins. So the top of the key just pops off and you also have a very fine point pin on both of them. But they just look so fantasy and just so beautiful, honestly, right? All right, cookies, I hope you enjoyed this very random haul video. Hopefully I'll be able to do some more dollar hauls once they get more of their haul. Halloween and fall things out. Be magical and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.